Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a video with Tally Sharpie on YouTube. She has a wonderful channel. It comprises of pretty much looks, tags, you name it, vlogs. Make sure you check it out. Um, today we're going to be doing a Spring Break Essentials video. Alright, so I'm going to start in like the order from like my feet up on the things that you need. So when you're obviously out in Spring Break, I mean on your Spring Break trip, you might obviously, you obviously need some shoes. I'm not taking heels only because like I'm... I've been on a number of spring breaks and it's not about like looking cute it's pretty much you having fun so even when you go partying and stuff like I, I really wouldn't wear heels I would just wear like flats or flip-flops so I have these these are um, Terry Birch flip-flops and they are nude so they pretty much go with like pretty much like almost literally everything so this is like a good option then I have these as well I have these espadrilles, they're from Zara, and they lace up a little bit, not too much. I am not a big, I actually recently just got it, I really like the, the heel length, I wish it was a bit um, higher, but this is perfectly fine. And the last pair of shoes that I have are these as well, and these are also lace up, they don't lace up like completely to the top, but they're decent enough, and these are, um, Brown. So I kind of have like a brown thing going on, not necessarily like you can wear black, any colors, you can wear bright colors because obviously it's springtime and I think that would be great. So these are like three shoe options that you should totally, obviously since it's going to be hot, you might want to like wear dresses, but at the same time it might be a little chilly because it's obviously still spring so a sweatshirt is actually appropriate, you can, you can carry on a sweatshirt with you. But this is a cute Ross dress. This is from Mura Boutique. It's like an Australian based website. But this is cute. It's bright and colorful. This is a perfect idea. I have this two piece. Um, this one is the top. It's just a little crop. I mean, yeah, it's a little crop. And then high waisted shorts. And that's how that looks like. And the last thing I'll show you guys is a top. This one's really cute as well. It's like off the shoulder, just like the blue one. But it has a little bit of frills. And I think you can like wear this with everything. You can wear this with like high-waisted shorts or a skirt or something. I think that would definitely be cute. Alright, so next thing I'm going to show you guys are accessories that you can definitely wear while you're on spring break because I'm not I'm not like the girliest person on earth or whatever but occasionally I like to look cute or I try to look cute and like this um what do you call this it's like a headband you can either wear like that or you can wear it as like a hair crown or something I don't know like this or something I think this is cute you should be able to accessorize with anything because I have um how do I put it I'm very I like African jewelry so I like to wear like African jewelry like everywhere but this is pretty much some of the stuff that I will be wearing while I'm on spring break this stuff right here another accessory like the headband that I showed you guys earlier is this one, but this one's in blue and that that's how it looks. It's really cute. Okay. Next accessory that would be great for pictures and all that crap is a little um floaty. I think that's what it's called. It's called a floaty or a float or whatever. But this is cute. I think it would be cute for like bright Instagram pictures. It's very vibrant. And I bought this from Rue 21. I definitely suggest that you search because like I was about to like buy it on Urban Outfitters for like 70 something dollars, which is like absolutely ridiculous. And Rue 21 was selling this for 20, I mean for 12 dollars, I'm sorry. So obviously like, and it's just a float, it's not like oh it has any name or anything, you just put air inside and you're good. So this is cute. Accessories. Um, Sunglasses are obviously a must. I have these two sunglasses that I'm going to take with me. These are Key sunglasses. I think they're called Key Australia or something. They're very, I love these. These are very chic and um, cat eyed. I think this is perfect for spring break. This is also another pair. 
these ones are also like more I don't know what to call them but these ones are Prada and I like the cat I mean it's not the cat eye the round eye of the glasses all right so next we're going to go on to facial beauty products like skincare all that crap all things you might need so obviously perfume is like you need to take perfume with you just so you smell nice everywhere you go this one's called olympia olympia or olympia it has like a sound like a like a thing on the e but this smells really good it doesn't have like a sweet smell it's like more of like a musky sexy smell i like i tend to like more masculine scents but obviously like you might want to have like a fresher scent if you want like a fresh scent while you're on spring break i think this is actually not necessarily like lavender fresh but it's a mixture of like fresh and sexy i think yeah that's the way i'll do it that's the only way i can describe this um scent all right so like i was saying i was talking about beauty like the things that some things that you might need like for instance i'm getting braids done not braids like box braids but like maybe like four or five braids because i kind of want to like have my hair like i don't have to like do anything to my hair while i'm there so but if you have like a weave or a wig or whatever you might need a curling iron most um hotels probably have like sh um blow dryers so you might not really need to take a straightener if you have a blow dryer you can like blow dry your hair to straightness and then you just might need like a curler or you can take like those curling um thingies the little curly things um since where i'm going is hard it's like you need to protect your makeup so for makeup i'm going to be taking my becca um what do you call this thing ever matte primer yeah i'm gonna take this with me because it's needed and also the makeup industry spray by Scandinavia. You should totally check out my girl's um, video. Her name is Tommy Popola here on YouTube. Definitely check her video out. She did like the review from me. And it's from the review that I went to go and buy these thingies. And they are truth. They are actually really good. I like them. Well, I haven't tried the primer spray. But I've used the finish I used the finishing spray today and I like it. So you should definitely check out her review if you want to get it. Because I think she had a code there. But I was able to get about I think 25 or 15 percent off of it so that's something you should totally check then you want like to get like an eye palette that's like perfect for spring and I just I love this palette if you're like on my snapchat you see that I like already like was like yo when I opened I was like Whew. sorry the colors are so vibrant and they're like neutral and then you, they also have like things that you can play around with so I think this is a really cute palette to have on your spring break if you don't want to like worry about carrying too many shadows you just want one thing to be together compact and all that stuff and i just take foundation and all that stuff i just thought like i'll show you guys things that are easily accessible too all right so next thing is i don't know but when i was showing you guys clothes i totally forgot like the most important thing you need swimsuits or bikinis or whatever you want to wear I'm kind of mad that I bought like black bikinis because I feel like ugh, this is so basic like damn I wish I got something different but I got this black bikini from fly nation yo that company like took like at least 10 years for them to send my eyes and like I ordered the stuff in January because I was going to uh, Miami for my friend's birthday and I didn't even get to go because like my flight got cancelled because of like the weather. But it came in like February, like the fuck. Anyway, <laughs> at least I got the items and I got the um the high waisted and it has like a little bit of skin showing on this side and a little bit of share goodness. Then I also got like a one piece. I'm like so obsessed with one pieces, like I'm not really a two piece fan. So I like one piece and I have another one in white. Next um, that you'll need on your spring break trip, you're going to need a hat. Because when you go to the beach and like, you know, you're just carefree about your hair. You're just like, oh God, you don't want to look a total mess. You can just wear a hat to cover that mess. Alright, hat would be cute. And then you could also get like, I'm taking 
I'm probably going to take like a face cap with me just because. Which brings me to my next point, sunscreen. Don't let anybody tell you that you're black, you don't need sunscreen. You need sunscreen. It's important to have sunscreen, especially because like a lot of a lot of makeup and products have like 20 SPF and all that stuff. So that's good. But I use like 50 SPF because actually I've gotten skin burnt before, like dead, and I got skin burnt in Florida. <laughs> So next thing, I know like I'm jumbled all over the place, but trust me, this is why it's important to have like a little reminder. You have like your list so that you can just check everything that you get so you don't forget. Next thing is like a mini purse or whatever you want to carry. I personally feel like this is not essential, but because like I, I probably will be touring the town that I'm in, so it's like. Even if I'm on spring break trying to have fun, I want to be able to put my stuff, find a place to put my stuff. So I have this mini Prada mini um, purse. And like this is like so perfect, putting everything inside. I don't know if this is the bag that I'm going to carry yet, but I'm just saying that this, a bag, a purse, anything is like perfect for you to carry. It fits my iPhone 6 Plus, so it's like perfect. It fits it in there, it's in there already. And I think another good idea is if you have like a phone case that has like the little wallet things to put your cards inside. The only thing is that, that one can't fit like if you have a key. But like since you're in your hotel, you put like your hotel card in there. That's something I'm probably going to buy. I found one on Velvet. I'm totally going off point. But I found one on Velvet Caviar. But theirs was like 28 and I found it on AliExpress for like 6 bucks. And the same black color, so I'm going to get that from AliExpress. Anyway, next thing is headphones for like your plane ride and just like when you're wandering around wherever you are before you get to your actual destination or whatever. I just think that having headphones is like, you know, if you're driving in the car, you don't want to listen to what your parents are listening to, all that stuff. You can just block them out with your headphones. Not advising you to do that if you have a Nigerian mother. Anyway, next thing is like speakers. I think these are so essential. Well, for me at least. I love music and I love beaches as well. So whenever I go to a beach, I just always have to listen to music. And my phone, my phone is not like loud enough in my opinion. Like, let me... Sorry, it was on the speaker, it was connected to the speaker, but my point pretty much is that my phone isn't loud enough, so I'd rather just have like, you know, a little music playing in the background while I'm just listening to the waves at the beach and stuff. So that's pretty much it for my um, essentials video. I hope this was quite useful to you guys and you guys could take away some stuff from this. Last thing actually before I go is this little background thing. This is actually, I'm going to take this with me. This is going to be like my little map for the beach. It's pretty much, I think this is like cute for the beach. And I bought this from Mira Boutique. I'll put all the things that I showed you guys in the description bar below. Also, don't forget to check Tally Sharp's video. She's amazing. Trust me. I love her makeup look. I love everything. So check it out. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.